Hello, it is now about 10 to 9 at night, and I'm a moron. I picked the flip up, uh, I turned it on, then my thing that I had in the microwave was beeping. I put the phone in my pocket and threw, well, the things that I was carrying, pressing the buttons of the camera in my pocket. It deleted all the footage, son of a bitch. So the three minutes of riveting, riv just riveting stuff that I shot today is just ruined, gone, dicked. I apologize, it was my mistake. All I did was wrap a pra uh, package for my, actually I didn't wrap it yet. Oh boy, you can see me wrap a package tonight. No, it came in the mail, it's for my dad. I, I, need, I put it in the box and got it ready to wrap to wrap, but I didn't wrap it yet, so I guess you'll be seeing that. Anyways, I just got off the phone with him. We're taking the M5 over tomorrow. Um, I saw somebody commented about the loaner car. Um, they are very limited on stock. They did give me a ring and told me that they do have one in if I want to do that. However, uh, to have a loaner car slash rental car in the state of Ohio, you've got to be 24 years old. It's the same as California for some reason. Uh, so legally, I can't get one. Of course, my dad would sign the paperwork and then I'd be driving it. But you know what? It's a day. That's not even worth the chance of getting in an accident in the freezing rain or something that we have around here. And then I would be in trouble for driving a car that would be legal for me to drive because I'm not 25. So that's not worth the shot. Um, but I'm going to go over there tomorrow, drop it off. My dad's going to bring me back. And then i got to go back Friday. Grandfather's going to take me over there. It feels like I'm in eighth grade again, getting rides everywhere I go, because I won't have a car for a day. But that's all right, because my headlights need fixed. So now I need to call him, uh, my grandfather, and make sure that he can take me over there Friday. If not, my dad's going to have to leave his new job early, which probably won't go over well. Come all the way over here from Cleveland to Hudson, Hudson to Akron, and then back to his place in Akron. So that would be a job. But we will do what it takes. So I'm going to call him, make sure he's available, and I'll talk to you in five minutes. Wow. You know how I said that was going to be five minutes? It turned out being about an hour and 25 minutes. Called my grandfather. He's in the, as he described it, he's in the middle of a rat's nest. Uh, he got into some problems with his uh, hot water heater. He's got water all over the place. They have no water in the house. It's just cocked. So he's got a plumber coming over tomorrow morning to fix it. Anyways, he is available to do that, so I'll get the car back Friday. But um, while talking with him, I ended up giving it a sponge bath in the garage. I got tired of seeing the salt all over it, so I just got a sponge and got it wet with the hose and pretty much went over the whole thing. So at least it looks clean now. I mean, it's actually not, but who cares? It's going to rain tomorrow. So tomorrow's Thursday. That equals my short day. I'm out at 125. I don't have to go in until 930, so that'll be fun. Uh, we also watched The Hangover Part 2. If you saw The Hangover 1, um, which they went they went to Vegas. If you don't know the movie, it's funny. Go rent it, watch it, download it, buy it. It's a good movie. But we watched Part 2. It was, uh, I think, better than the original one. It was pretty funny. Uh, I think it, there was a lot more language and a lot more sexual content, which in some cases makes it funnier, but it was good, so I recommend watching Hangover Part 2. Well, it's over 80 degrees Fahrenheit outside. Bullshit! Yeah, this thing's dicked. I don't know why the outdoor one is always wrong. The indoor one's right. It's about 50. The actual exterior... Exterior. The actual outside temperature is right around 50 degrees or so. It's actually not cold. I didn't wear a coat the whole time I was out here cleaning the car. I also went over the exhaust tips again with some more WD-40. They had gotten a little bit of carbon in there. You can see it's a little bit of floor whenever I started. Anyways, uh, I'm going to go in now, wrap that present, put this together, and uh, try to go to bed a little bit earlier and get some more YouTube videos watched in my two-hour watch later playlist. All right, I've got Cannon on hold. I'm going to film a quick clip. Here's this thing from my dad, so if you watch this, here it is. Yep, that is there. Only Cannon knows what it is. So there's what I have wrapped so far, and there's a cat. Hi. How you doing? Uh, that's all I've done today. Sorry that I screwed up and deleted that footage. I don't think there's like three buttons that you have to press in order to make those clips disappear, and I don't even know how that happened, but it did. So I'm sorry. But 367 here. I'll talk to you tomorrow, Thursday, in 368. So thanks for watching and good night.